Joining me now is the team captain, at least one of the team captains, special teams captain Matthew Slater. Good to see you, my friend. Good to see you, as always. How has the bye week been coming off the bye? Yeah, you know, it, it's interesting. Latest bye week in NFL history, mm -hmm. which uh, has been different dealing with and managing, but I think we took advantage of the time off, got a chance to do some good self-scout, got a chance to rest and then hit a mental reset. And I think our focus has been pretty good this week, getting back to work, understanding that now uh, is the more, most important part of our season. So this is a huge test for us this weekend, playing the Colts. We know we have to be at our best, and hopefully we can do that Saturday night. As a captain, do you find it, it is necessary to discuss with everything that's going on with COVID right now to remind your team what you should do, what you shouldn't do? Mm -hmm. Have you done that? Yeah, look, I... We've addressed it as best we can. I think um, we understand what's at stake for our football team, but we know we can't do that unless we're healthy. But at the same time, you know, guys have to live their lives. I mean, guys have children, they got wives, they got family, they got a lot going on outside the building. And you don't want guys to totally put that on hold because that's time you can't get back. So I think for us, it's about uh, being intentional with the decisions that we make, being thoughtful with it and just trying to be as smart as we can so that we can be healthy uh, down the stretch here. Next big game, Indianapolis. Here you come. Are you excited for this one? Yeah, this is a huge one. I, I think there's always been uh, a competitive matchup there between Indy and, and us dating back to even before I was here. So uh, this is a huge game for them. It's a huge game for us. We're both trying to get in the playoffs. Um, we both are jockeying for position, if you will. So we know what's at stake here. And, um, you know, th this is a team that's well coached. They've got stars all over the place. Um, I think they're a much better team than what their record would indicate. And this is going to be a huge challenge for us. One last thing. What do you like most about this football team? Our togetherness. Mm. Um, I think this is a very close-knit group. Uh, I truly believe we all enjoy being around one another. We enjoy the camaraderie. We enjoy the banter. We enjoy going through the process of the season together. And what I've seen over the last several months is, is this group just become closer and closer and really lean in on one another. And the good teams that I've been on, they, they've been the teams that have really been brothers uh, on the field, but off the field as well. Mm -hmm. And that becomes so cliche in football, um, but I really see it this year. And I love that, that we have that sense of brotherhood and it's fun to be a part of. Uh, I've had as much fun with this group as I've had with any group, and I'm very appreciative of that. You've seen this team grow certainly, together, huh? Certainly. When I mean, you think about the new faces, uh, whether, you know, obviously rookies and Mac and those crew and that crew, uh, free agents coming in, what we've done is really meshed together uh, very well, and, it, you know, that says a lot about the character of this football team and the men that are in that locker room. Good luck in Indy. Thanks a lot. Appreciate it. You got it.